One of the books from Banner that I treasure is William Guthrie's The Christian Great Interest, Christian's Great Interest. It's in the uh, Puritan paperback series. As a young believer, I really struggled with assurance of salvation. Was I really converted? Uh, did I have true faith or was it spurious faith like I read about in the Bible and had heard about in sermons? And Guthrie helped me in so many ways because I would listen to other people's testimony and I would start comparing mine with theirs. And uh, that was not helpful at all because God leads us all in different ways and through different experiences. And Guthrie helped me with that, to, to see that the way people get to Christ uh, is often in very different ways. There's only one way to God, but there are many ways to Christ. Some uh, have deep conviction for a long period of time. Uh, some joy is a, an overwhelming theme. And for some, coming to Christ resonates with them and their experience to others looking and to others trusting or calling or many of the synonyms for faith in the Bible. And uh, Guthrie helped me to see uh, you don't have to be able to, to figure out and incorporate into your experience all expressions of faith at one time simultaneously. Uh, you don't have to have the testimony of every other Christian uh, to be truly um, interested in Christ, to have that saving great interest. And I would recommend uh, someone to read this book if they were struggling with assurance. Uh, I would uh, encourage them to uh, keep their eyes on Christ through the book, not keep their eyes on Guthrie through the book, but to see the truth that he unfolds. And I would suggest pastors read the book as well because of preaching, offering Christ freely, uh, learning different ways to express that offer, um, and also for helping people, counseling people who are struggling with assurance. The things I learned in my own experience through the lens of Guthrie uh, have helped me when I've gone into my study with someone who's struggling and maybe deeply troubled about whether or not they're a true believer.